as training camp is just around the corner, it seems that a bunch of players for the Tennessee Titans are not on the PUP list. But linebacker Monty Rice is. So let's get in to why Monty Rice starts this season on the PUP list. But above all else, remember to tighten up. Tell them boys to tighten up. Tighten up. Let me hear you say. Oh, sit again, hype now. Tell them boys to tighten up. Tighten up. Let me hear you say. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we are as we're going to get into why Monty Rice is on the pup list. So, we have the Titans announcing the pup list and keeping off notable names as Robert Woods, Christian Fulton, and Caleb Farley. But three notable names were added to the list. That being linebacker Monty Rice, who we're mainly talking about today, and then tight end Tony Hudson and rookie kicker Caleb Shudik. We're all placed on the physically unable to perform list, a.k.a. the pup list. All three are, are continue on with their rehabilitation process and cannot participate in practices until they are cleared medically and returned to the active roster. So, the main person we're talking about tonight is this. Monty Rice, the first of Tennessee's two third-round picks in 2021, the number 92nd overall, played eight games for a rookie for the Titans before an Achilles injury sent him to injury reserve when he spent the final five weeks of the campaign. Before he was hurt, he made 30 tackles, including a team-high 10 against New Orleans in his second start. The expectation is that when healthy, he will become the primary backup starter for Zach Cunningham and David Long at inside linebacker this season. Now, when you look at Monty Rice's collegiate stats at the University of Georgia, they don't really jump on the board for you at inside linebacker. But 89 tackles in the SEC is really good for a guy that starts 14 games. He had 50 his senior year, 9. The whole thing is you're hoping he can come through and really be that secondary option as a primary backup for the Titans. It's what you're really hoping for, hoping he can have really good games like he did against New Orleans, leading with 10 tackles. I know, guys, this is a shorter video, and this is not the video y'all expected to have today. Y'all expected to have the LAW Wrestling Classic Part 2, but just some emotional stuff has been going on with me lately, and I just don't think that's where the headspace for me is. Um, The videos haven't been doing as successful as I wanted them to do with the wrestling content. So I think for right now, at least until I feel like I'm in the mood to make them again, I think I'm going to stay towards my... NFL Titans content, especially with the season coming up. I think that's going to be good for me. I hope you guys understand. If you don't, that's fine. I understand. If you need to unsubscribe, that's fine. I understand too. But I hope you guys, if y'all guys love the Titans as much as I do, I hope you hit the like button. Above all else, this has been your boy Cass, and I'm out. But always remember to tighten up. Tell them boys to tighten up. Up. Let me hear you say it. Oh, sit again, hype now. Tell them boys to tighten up. Tighten up. Let me hear you say it. Nisa.